Yes, we are going to talk about Christmas and the annual Christmas tree festival at the Allen County Museum. And join me today, we've got the director of the museum, uh, Amy Kraft Clausen, in to tell us more. And Amy, it's not too soon to be thinking about this because we need people getting organized and register and get volunteers together, right? Yes, absolutely. It's, it's amazing. I can't believe it's been another year, but it's the 50th anniversary. Oh, so it's a nice. spectacular um, um, event that's coming up. I can't believe it's been 50 years for the event as well. So it's pretty, it's pretty crazy. Yeah, that's very special. It okay. is. So the dates are set November 30th to December 4th. And so, of course, we need people to bring trees. So I assume the registration deadline is going to be coming up, so people need to think about that, right? A absolutely. So the registration deadline is the end of the month. It's the um, uh, last day of the month, basically. Um, that will allow people to kind of get everything organized. The planning committee will be able to put all the trees um, together, get everything organized, get all the printing materials ready to go. So, you know, we're, we're looking forward to an exciting year, mm -hmm. actually. It should be fun. And this just doesn't happen on its own. You need volunteers for this, don't you? A absolutely. And, and this year we're really excited because we have um, a new partner, which is the Allen County Master Gardener Volunteers. So they're, they oversee, actually, the, the uh, Children's Garden. Okay. So it's fantastic to have them um, joining us. We're excited about that. And so it's going to be a little bit new for them. They participated last year, but this year they um, are an official uh, partner. So we're really excited to welcome them. Mm -hmm. um, but certainly it, it, it's time for everybody to get, get organized, start thinking about a goal golden theme because we're kind of fo focusing on um, 50 years and in, in, in the golden anniversary. Oh, so we'll probably see a lot of trees with gold on it and stuff. Yeah, wow. we're hoping. We're That'll hoping. That'll be neat. Yeah. All right. So get your get yourself in there and then, you know, just mark it on your calendars too because it's always a great family time and you get so many people that walk through the museum for this. Absolutely. And, and just to make things easy, um, uh, people can get registration forms on the website and they can also send them in. They can download them and then send them in if they prefer. All right. Very good. So we're getting ready for Christmas. Awesome. All all right, also getting ready for um, the presidential exhibit is actually going to be wrapping up soon, right? And you yeah. still have a, another event coming up? Yeah, we have, um, actually, we're going to, on Saturday, we have our fundraiser that's um, connected to that, so we're excited about that. That's um, uh, basically sold out, so we're um, pleased with that. And then on the 20th of um, this month, we actually have one last um, cur curator's um, tour. Um, the space is limited for that, so if people are interested, they can come and hear um, uh, Christine Shearer, uh, Fowler Shearer speak. She's going to guide people through that um, the, the tour at, in the gallery so it'll be a little bit different than her lecture because she's going to be able to talk about some of the objects and all of that stuff and then um, the end of the month we actually had Fred Steiner and he is going to do a Sunday lecture and talk about some things related to Bluffton and um, Halloween mm -hmm. and um, different um, kind of themes um, that, that will, I think, spark people's imagination for that holiday kind of yeah. um, idea. And that's on Sunday the 30th, right, the day before Halloween, so that's a really Absolutely. good one. Yeah, yeah it's have. perfect timing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, let's go back to the presidential exhibit, because do you think that the people have embraced that and it's, it's gone really well the way you thought it would be? I mean, because it, it's such a unique experience for us and so many great things are at the museum for that. You know, we have been looking at the evaluations as um, people have gone through the museum and, and, and I would say it has been one of our most well-received um, exhibits since Terrific. I've been with the museum. So mm -hmm. I'm, I'm really happy overall with um, how things have come together. It makes me really excited. I think it's been a great thing for the community and it's not only touched our community, but it's been able to reach um, people who've been traveling, certainly people who traveled during summer and a lot of people just kind of um, said they came in specifically to see the exhibit oh. and it's also brought people who have not been to the museum in quite some time oh, so, neat. so that that all, all those pieces came together I think really nicely for us right yeah that's awesome okay so don't forget register for the Christmas tree festival now thanks for coming today thank you all right don't go away we'll take a look at the weather forecast next